from a solid cylinder whose height is 2.4 cm they said from a solid cylinder whose height is 2.4 cm and diameter 1.4 cm a conical cavity a conical cavity of the same height and same diameter is hollowed out find the total surface area of the remaining solid to the nearest centimeter square okay now they are saying total surface area so always keep in your mind ki we need to find out the surface area okay let us see the figure here now a cylinder is there from that we have taken out this conical portion this one this one we have taken out now as this conical portion is taken out now imagine that solid without this conical portion so you, and another thing is that you need to find out the surface area so in the remaining solid which area is there where you are able to touch so outer csa of the cylinder you are able to touch base you are able to touch and this cavity is there na here at this portion also at this conical portion also you are able to touch correct top the you cannot able to touch this one why because already you have taken out this conical portion so only this csa of cone you are able to touch csa of the cone then csa of the cylinder and area of the base only this surfaces three surfaces are there okay so let us write it down now here they have given you diameter diameter of the uh, this one cylinder which is 1.4 cm so i'll write it down here d which is equal to 1.4 cm so radius is equal to 0.7 cm and height which is equal to 2.4 cm this is about the cylinder okay height and radius of the cylinder and the cone is same already they said so to get the csa of the cone we will need the slant height l so which is equal to under root r square plus h square we'll substitute the values here so r is here let me write properly r which is equal to 0.7 square plus h means 2.4 square okay so 0.7 square means 0.49 plus square of 2.4 it is 5.76 as we add it we are getting 6.25 and square root of this one is what 2.5 cm so we got the slant height now we'll find out the surface area of the solid okay so here they said to find out total surface area of the so as they use the total surface area na you start using the total surface area formula no you have to look at the solid they are asking you the total surface area of the solid okay so here total surface area of solid which is equal to here i'll write down which is equal to csa of the cylinder which is 2 pi r h plus area of the base which is pi r square and csa of the cone which is pi r l okay now see what can you take common pi r is there everywhere so pi r is out 2 h plus r plus l now we'll substitute the values here pi means 22 by 7 radius it was 0.7 in the bracket 2 h h was 2.4 plus radius is 0.7 here plus slant height came as 2.5 okay now this 7 and 7 got cancelled but one decimal place so 0.1 0.1 into 22 it will become 2.2 in the bracket 4.8 plus 0.7 plus 2.5 we'll do the addition of this one here 
which is equal to 2.2 this is 15 and 5 20 so 0 2 to 4 here 8 so after multiplying this one we are getting it as 17.6 centimeter square but what they said you know they told you write the answer to the nearest centimeter square simply you have to round off this number so when we do round off of this number we are getting it as 18 centimeter square in the bracket you can write down approximately okay complete the spelling or you can write down a short form approximately so the surface area of the solid is 18 centimeter square approximately i hope all of you understood this sum thank you